In this short, I will be giving an overview of palpation of axillary lymph nodes. To palpate the anterior group of axillary lymph nodes, clinician's finger of the opposite hand to the side being examined should be insinuated behind the pectoralis major muscles with the patient's arm resting on the clinician's forearm and then the clinician should try to palpate the lymph nodes with the pulp of the finger as you can see in the corresponding diagram. To palpate the lateral group of axillary lymph nodes, clinician palms of the same hand to the side being examined are directed laterally against the upper end of the humerus and then the clinician should try to palpate the lymph nodes as you can see in the corresponding diagram. To palpate the posterior group of axillary lymph nodes, the clinician should stand behind the patient and should hold the patient's semi-lifted arm with one hand and should try to palpate the antero internal surface of the posterior fold of axilla with the palm of the other hand as you can see in the corresponding diagram. To palpate the central group of axillary lymph nodes, clinician's extended fingers of the examining hand are passed up to apex of axilla with the palm directing towards the lateral thoracic wall with the patient's forearm being kept on clinician's forearm of the examining hand and the clinician should put the other hand on the patient's shoulder as you can see in the corresponding diagram. Same steps are carried out for palpation of the apical group of axillary lymph nodes with just the fingers being pushed further up for palpation of the apical group of lymph nodes. To know more about the palpation of axillary lymph nodes, you can check out my YouTube video on the same, the link for which has been mentioned in the description below. Thank you.